Hello, friends. I wanted to share an idea and get your thoughts on it. At the end of the war, the Germans sent a train loaded with gold to Poland and hid it in one of the tunnels, then blew up the entrance. Many people have tried to find it, but to no avail. It seemed hope was lost until 2002 when a German passed away, and his relatives found a diary that mentioned not only the train, but also 28 tons of gold transported by trucks to Poland, hidden in deep wells and lakes. There are now plans to create robots that could help locate this treasure. One would be a sonar-equipped boat that autonomously scans the lake beds, creating detailed maps of the lake floors. Many archaeologists have previously attempted to find these hidden treasures, but with the advancement of technology, methods for underwater exploration have become both more affordable and accessible. Not taking advantage of this would be like passing up the last slice of pizza, I thought. Previously, explorations were done with divers, but divers can only stay underwater for 20 to 30 minutes, which greatly limits the scope of exploration. The second robot would be a submarine that could dive to the bottom for a more detailed inspection of the area. Share your thoughts in the comments, because right now it seems like finding the gold train might actually be easier than finding common sense. I'd also like to share some projects I'm currently working on. One is called LightTrack. Using a radar module, it detects people and lights up their path. The unique feature is that the radar only reacts to living objects, ignoring inanimate ones. This device is perfect for staircases, corridors, and as a nightlight. The project has successfully launched on Kickstarter, receiving the first 20 orders. If you're interested, you can buy it on the website. The link is in the video description. The next project is a joystick-controlled manipulator that can replace a regular mouse, but is much more precise and user-friendly. It's been in development for three months and will soon be finished. I'm also working on a home turret with AI that uses a camera and thermal imaging to recognize people. No, it won't shoot at uninvited guests, but it can scare off thieves or make a cool gadget. Additionally, I'm developing a robot for territory exploration. I previously built a similar robot for underbus inspections, but it was too expensive and hard to control. Now the goal is to make it cheaper and equip it with a thermal camera and manipulator. Thanks for watching.